Welcome back guys. Next to me we have a Mercedes Benz. The car's been previously wrapped before. Um, looks like the wrap is not looking so good. So we're going to be taking taking the wrap off for the clients, rewrapping the vehicle in something a little bit more funky, a little bit more fun. Um, yeah, hopefully taking this one to the next level. Cool. What's up guys? Next to me we have a 3 Series. Car came in for a few little touches. Film used was Avery Dennison Satin Stunning Orange. Beautiful color. First time we've worked with it. Really, really impressed with it. Um, we did some pinstriping for the client and we did a propeller kit and we did the M badge kits. All done in this Avery color. Come and have a look what it looks like guys. So on the front, we did a 30 mil pin and a 3 mil strap. That's one of our M overlays done in the same color. Down the side of the car, we've done a 10 mil, 10 mil strap for the clients. On the rear, we carried on with the 10 mil strap through, finished off with the propeller overlays, our cool little logo in the back, smoked the lights with S-Tech smoke, PPF. So yeah, something different. This was all client request, so we can do that type of stuff for you guys. Client also gets to take home a few pin stripes if anything goes wrong. Um, he can play with it further. So yeah, we hope that you enjoy this one guys and come get some. Memphis man. Welcome back guys. Behind me we got an F56. We've done a few little odds and ends on. Next to me we've got the owner. His name's Gino. Really, really cool guy. So Gino, you you brought us your vehicle. We did a few things on it. How did you hear about us? 
Well, firstly, I check you guys out on Facebook. Okay. Uh, and I check some of the work that you guys are doing on Facebook and Instagram. All right. I uh, followed you guys for a couple of months and I uh, saw some amazing cars and amazing stuff that you were doing. And then I decided, you know what? Our car was in a cross at SMG, so I decided, okay. you know what? Drop the car for one time and let's give you guys a call. Okay. okay. Yeah. So you're on Facebook, Instagram. What do you. Is that personal or um, so I'm um, personal in a personal capacity I'm on Facebook and Instagram and that's where I uh, found you guys out okay um, and I'm also on the mini modified group uh, for the US and UK guys all right um, and also the mini owners club you um, KZN. KZN yeah KZN yeah. so I was speaking to Gino before doing the shoot and he was just telling me about how the guys in KZN and about yeah. how the guys in South Africa need parts and need yeah. little things that they can do on their minis yeah. so hopefully here at Salomon Brothers we'll be able to give you guys those little extras you know things yeah. that you can do on your car um, stuff that's happening in the UK and in the States and maybe not happening here yeah, so, yeah. so okay it's, yeah, the, 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 the basic stuff so I mean you know like uh, trim, trim detail okay. and, uh, and the, the blackout kits and stuff um, if we have to get it in South Africa we have to get it either from the UK or the US um, we don't actually have anyone here who's actually making it for us. Perfect. Um, so, you know, now that we have someone that is... So seeing the kit that we fitted to your vehicle, the little bits that we've done, would you, what would you, how would you rate how they came out? Um, honestly, 10 out of 10. Okay. Like, You're not just it, saying that because i <laughs> <laughs> Even 100, even 100 out of 100. I mean, it's, it looks better than, um, I think it's the quality of the, of the, of the kit uh, okay. that's gone a long way as well. Um, it looks better than the kits that you get from overseas. No awesome. doubt about it. So guys, um, yeah. that's an oak from the from the actual yeah. club saying the kit's better than what, what you yeah, think yeah. it is. So um, you I've know what? I've seen it close up, I've seen it first hand. And, awesome. uh, and fitments look pretty easy. Pretty easy, uh, okay. pretty DIY. Cool, yeah. awesome. So if these oaks want to follow you, what are, you, what are your um, socials? You can follow me on Facebook at Gino Joan Nike, or you can follow me on Instagram at uh, underscore Indian Stanley. Awesome. Thanks, Gino. Let me take these oaks around and show them what we've done to your car. Come through, guys. So on the front, we did our S kit in white. Had the factory stickers fitted. We blacked these out. All done with hexes film. On the side, we've got the mini badges on the wheels, pretty cool little touch in white, just to bring a bit of color down. We've got a overlay kit there going on. And then if you see, along the bolt line of the vehicle, we've run a black bolt line kit. All gloss black, high gloss. So that looks pretty cool, dig that. Handles, we wrapped, gloss black. Fuel cap was wrapped also. In the back, we got our Cooper overlay, gloss black, S and white. And then down here has been wrapped in gloss black and all the trimming done. All right, guys. So you heard it from myself and Gino. I really, really want to thank him for coming out, bringing his car through and just yeah, sharing the love. But thanks again, guys, and come get some.
Sanmanan Buffet with Tamela Musbonga, Amoli Sales Person Lai Solomon Brothers. Excellent one, we have a brand new Porsche Carrera S911, which came in for PPF application. In Moto, si apply ile, in PPF, for goes and process it open. In Zimbabwe, if you can look closely, the, the film is clear. And go, we born in Mao, go to pass most of the We are born. So, Moto, si incha, customer list, and get for straight from Porsche, la, and Tanga, la, less a Latina goes. Is all this is all apply a film before the seven season can go. We have been high, we can't just be comfortable. Put it in Moto, in a, in a, in a, in a stone chips and scratches and everything so in moto si apply ile if you know um zimba wonke front bumper rear bumper side fenders door like mirrors now like on the roof on top la my pillars la we roof so apply ppf so the car is protected i hope the client will be happy <laughs> um how would you like to review your subscription <laughs> Hardy die <da> right there. <laughs> that is the Kina. That is disgusting. I didn't expect that of a young man of your stature. <laughs> What's up, guys? Next to me, we have a C Class um, in your plain Jane White. The client had the car wrapped. Um, We'll put some B-roll of the vehicle in now. Car's going in new color. Um, Saturn night blue from Avery Denison. Come and have a look. So, color's really cool. We've wrapped a few cars in this color. I think this is the fourth car. So, yeah, excited. We're gonna do some really cool little things for the client. She doesn't really know about it, but surprise her. So we're gonna do our new banner with our new logo on it, which is pretty cool. Um, and then a little bit of black accents here and there, and come up with some door cup options for the Mercedes. But yeah, excited to wrap this. And it was nice because I got to see the issues that the previous wrap had on it. So I can implement overlays and underlays and just make sure that my layering is right. Um, because yeah, not everything's one piece, guys. Just know that in wrapping, it's about longevity and making sure that the wrap not only looks good, but obviously lasts because the client's spending the money. Otherwise, you're gonna have repetitive comebacks and yeah, comebacks mean money, um, mean loss in film. So just remember that, guys, okay? Learn from your mistakes and if you lay something and it pulls back or whatever the case may be is, it's obviously too much tension in a place so yeah we'll do some little bit of wrapping tutorial on this Merc just some simple stuff laying hoods how to get your corner game strong um, simple flat panels so yeah stay tuned